First of all, we are going to meet the coordinator of MedSpring project that explains what the EMEC is. Hi Claudio, do you mind telling how to the EMEC was born and what its objectives are? Well, the EMEC was born because we think that I mean, we have to keep uh, alive the dialogue uh, uh, between the Euro, uh, the, the EU countries and the internal partner countries and I think that I mean, the Euromed uh, expert group, which is the EMEC, can be a tool to keep this dialogue alive among the scientists and bring also to the political level some of the issues that the scientists together, not the South, they have agreed. The EMEC represents an experiment to Nexus approach. How do you prepare the EMEC group to answer at the several issues? Well, well that's, I thank you very much for this question because actually, I mean, the EMEC is not working all alone, although there are I mean, more than 50 experts I mean, included as members of, of, of the group, uh, we prepare, for example, the, the first and second meeting on EMEC uh, through also launching campaigns and, uh, uh, and asking the people, the people in the road and also other scientists, what they think about the certain issues which, address, which uh, EMEC needs to so we try to prepare EMEG also by bringing on the table what the civil society uh, thinks about some issues. Okay. Is the Nexus the new buzzword? What is new about Nexus that did not exist in common knowledge? There is nothing new in my opinion about Nexus itself. Uh, I think we have to, to use the Nexus and see the Nexus more as a concept uh, which will help us to pull together uh, the water, food and energy uh, challenges in a more integrated way in order to contribute to the sustainable development of the Euro Mediterranean region and not only even beyond this region. But it's a concept, it's a concept which we have to use in order to really give a more push to the sustainable development. And another question, how the social and ethical dimensions are addressed in Nexus approach? Well, uh, I think Nexus has one, when I say that the Nexus has to contribute to sustainable development, we have to, I mean, we have to use the Nexus to get today in order to put together water, energy and food and all the research and the technologies we have at disposal in these domains in order to improve, for example, the access of the people to the resources, which is both a social issue and also an, an ethical issue. So we should not only think about the environment per se and say, okay, well, let's reduce the, the use of water, maintaining the same amount of food or biomass produced and at the same time optimizing energy, but the Nexus should also help in this new concept, should also help to, to improve the access to the resources, to be more democratic in the access to resources. This is an ethical issue. Claudio Bogliotti, thank you so much okay. and your involvement in Euro Mediterranean initiatives is very much appreciated. Thank you very much, thank you. Thank you.